Hello, my name is Andreas um, I'm running the Flexi class system for LTL Language School and I want to explain to you how to book a class in LTL Flexi classes. For this I will make myself a little bit small so you can see my screen and you can see what I am doing. The first thing you want to do is go to settings and just make sure that you have your time zone correct because that's quite important. So for me that's Beijing, no problem. Then you can choose your language here, the language that you want to Study. So there are two different ones. Here is the language that I want the system to be played in for me, and this is the language I want to study. Let's say I want to study Mandarin. For example, my level is HSK2, and I want to study group classes. I could also study 101 classes. And then I save the changes. And here I am. In this section, I can also go to my profile. I can fill out information which is useful for teachers, and I can go to our forum, which is super useful, and I definitely recommend everybody to have a look at. Now you can also get your certificates, where you can get your graduation certificates after you've finished the course, and a blog and a lot of other inf interesting information in there. Now anyways, now once you've done that, now let's book a class. There are two different ways of booking a class in Flexi classes. Either you book a class the Flexi way, or you book a full course. Let me show you the differences. First, let's book a class the Flexi way. So now what you do there, is you can book a class at any time whenever you want. So let's say for example here I want to say on Saturday there is I want to study in the morning at let's say 9 a.m. there's a class and I go ahead and book that class and now I've got a class booked for me. So this is super easy. Flexi Classes offers a class for every hour of the day for each level. So there are at least 24 classes offered every day in each level. Each lesson lasts 60 minutes. Sometimes you might have even two lessons offered during one hour. So then actually per day you're offering in reality there are more than 24 lessons offered. But there are at least 24. So that means at any hour of the day in your level you can study a class. Now you can also track your progress under my level here. So that's where you see which classes you've studied or which ones you might want to choose to skip. So if you don't want to study one you can just say all right I want to skip this topic and you will not be uh, told to study these classes anymore. So here you can watch your progress under my level. You can again change your languages here if you want to but usually you stick with the language that you are in. Now this is for book a class. You also have recommended classes so these are the next level classes for you. There are a lot of useful filters in here that I recommend you to have a look at. But first at the beginning if you want to book a class just go here and take one whenever you're free. Let's say Saturday three o'clock and here we go confirm book and there it is. Now the other option is a more structured, a bit more traditional way of studying online. So that's a full course. So for this go to full courses. Now a full course follows the exact curricula in exact order, always goes through a full level. You have to follow the strict time, so it's always at a specific time when you're studying. So for example, let's say you want to study a standard that's four hours per week on weekdays course. So you're looking, these are the courses currently offered here. Let's say, for example, there is one starting on the 10th of July. 10th of July, and now in my time zone, it, this is 1 to 3 a.m. every morning. Maybe not so perfect. Let me look for another one. What about this one starting on the 1st of July? Now, this one is from 7 to 9 p.m. Perfect for me. So I can either book all of them or I can just book some of those classes. This is completely up to me. So that is, for example, if I just want to book one, here we go book that one right now or I could book the whole thing. We recommend to book several of them together because you do want to follow a course if that's how you study. All right now I've booked the course the classes now how do I study it? Super easy go to my classes and here you can see all your future upcoming classes and you can see your next upcoming class. So it's starting in three days and here, once the class starts, five minutes before the class, a link will appear that, where I can enter the Zoom meeting. I can add classes to my calendar here, so then I will have all these classes uh, going into my Google Outlook or Apple calendar. All right, so I have my future classes here. I can also click on a future class, and now I can see my teaching materials. So I can beforehand download class materials and can review them if I want to know what is going to be 
taught before the class already. I can also see who my teacher is, so in this case Connie here, and this is an introduction of Connie, and I can see all future classes of Connie as well. Now, another thing is when I go to my classes, after a class it will appear under pa my past classes. Now, if I click on here, I can see again the teaching materials, but I can also see the annotated PDF. So during the class, the teacher will be taking notes inside the PDF, example sentences, additional vocabulary, and so on, uh, and then upload this PDF here, which you can then download with one click again, and there it is. And so there the teacher will have written special examples in there, so this is for you to revise the class afterwards. And that's it. So you go to credits, that's where you get your subscription. If you're not sure how it works, click on the, fle click on the Flexi Credit Help, it explains it quite well there. Or just send us an email if you have any questions. Go to our forum here. The forum is super good. All your questions will be answered there. Sign in with your Flexi class details and we will be helping you to get a reply straight away. All right, great to have you with us.